And getting confirmation, the snares open, Cygnus now released. Uh, the release coming at 6.26 a.m. Central Time, while the station and Cygnus flying just over the eastern part of Bolivia in South America. You can see the vehicle now slowly backing away from the station's robotic arm. And the robotic arm now backing away from Cygnus while the vehicle sits in free drift still. Again, the release coming at 6.26 a.m. Central Time, 7.26 a.m. Eastern, while the International Space Station was flying just over the eastern part of Bolivia in South America. So Cygnus now flying free, the robotic arm going to back away um, to its final park position, at which point Cygnus will... Uh, fire thrusters under control by the teams in Dulles in Virginia, the orbital ATK flight control team. And there you can see Cygnus slowly beginning to fly away from the International Space Station. This again, Orbital ATK's fourth commercial resupply flight to the station. The vehicle delivered over 7,700 pounds of supplies to the Expedition 45s and 46 crew. having you on board our space station for so long, and thanks to all the folks at, uh, in Houston and in Dulles especially that provided this great vehicle for us. It's uh, been a pleasure. So some congratulatory words from Expedition 46 Commander Scott Kelly to the teams down here on the ground, uh, both in Mission Control Houston and out at Orbital ATK, the uh, commercial resupply uh, providers for this vehicle, Cygnus, which delivered over 7,700 pounds of cargo to the International Space Station when it arrived back in December. Now, though, Cygnus departing after a mission well done, um, making its way away from the station, setting up for that eventual deorbit burn coming up on Saturday. But again, the release coming successfully at 6.26 a.m. Central, 7.26 a.m. Eastern, while the station flew over the eastern part of Bolivia. Uh, the Cygnus vehicle now executed its departure burn, going to begin widening the gap between itself and the orbiting laboratory. Again, all of this setting up for that deorbit uh, and burn up over the in the Earth's atmosphere on Saturday. So we're going to pick up back in the other procedure with the uh, arm safing. Concur, Scott.
And just for the sake of thoroughness, as you guys probably guessed, the departure burn is complete. We saw that. So with that, Cygnus continuing to fade off in the distance, the separation burn having been completed after Cygnus was released at 6.26 a.m. Central, 7.26 a.m. Eastern, while uh, the both Cygnus and the station were flying over the eastern part of Bolivia. Uh, 